let's continue our chapter the human skeletal system the next topic is joints so first of all we will have a reading and then explanation the point at which two or more bones meet is called a joint they allow us to move the different parts of our body what are joints these are the points at which two or more bones meet so those points are called joints what are their functions they help us to move the different parts of our body joints are categorized by their range of movement immovable or fibrous joints don't allow movement for example the skull is made of immovable bony plates freely movable joints move in different directions they are present in different places in our body such as hip shoulders elbows knees wrists and ankles so according to the range of movement means whether they are movable or not the joints are categorized into two types immovable and freely movable immovable joints as the name suggests these don't allow movement these are also known as fibrous joints for example skull is made up of immovable bony plates and second are freely movable joints here also the name suggests these joints are free to move in different directions they are present in different parts of our body like hip shoulders elbows knees wrists and ankles